Hello everyone. So in this video, we're going to talk about the tasks, uh, how you can set up a task uh, for click documents and uh, uh, some interaction with them. So, okay, in order to set up a task uh, on any published document, so you can see we cannot see any documents in here. So I'm going to go to the document section here. I can see all the published documents in your click database, uh, click view server. So I'm just going to click on this document as soon as I click that. So I have this information available. So I'm going to for in order to set up a task, which is also called reloading uh, by server. So I'm going to click on the reload part and here I can set up uh, different uh, uh, frequencies like hourly, daily, weekly, monthly, continuously. So continuously means that it's going to reload, save, reload, save, reload, save. So it's going to be continuous uh, and that way. Uh, it can be from an other task. So for example, I have a couple of tasks already set up. So it can be on based on fail in case of failure or success. Uh, these tasks can be triggered and uh, it can be an other external event like EDX. Uh, there is a whole uh, lot of documentation about EDX. If you're interested, you can go and lo look up for yourself. And uh, then we have uh, so in, in certain cases, if you have second access, so you must add uh, second access user and password here. Um, uh, uh, if my user that is uh, uh, my click view server user uh, that I'm going uh, through which are running my services. So how to change that user? I have shared another video about that as well. So you can just look into that. Uh, but that user should be in your second access. Otherwise, you need to add your section access uh, user admin user in here so that your uh, task can be loaded successfully otherwise it's gonna fail uh, that per task is gonna fail so that is another important thing while you are running the task okay so uh, i'm gonna go for daily one for this one and uh, i can also set up which time it's going should be running so for time time being i'm gonna leave it as is and i'm gonna say click apply and now if i go to my status here so if you can see uh, i can see another task so but uh, my task most of the tasks are in here click demo but this one is in default so how i can change that so i can just click in here in edit window so th if you see this edit window is exactly the same that we have already seen and if i go to reload so this is exactly the same properties that we have seen in here but uh, uh, and also there is this tab which was already there so we can use this tab to categorize our tasks so I have the click demo here or I can have an other one like uh, movies team so there can be multiple teams or we can you know find ways to manage those tasks so now if I just refresh it so I have this movies one and or I can add that in click demo uh, and I have that in here okay so uh, no, I can run this task. So this is set up scheduled. But if I want to run the task from here, I can just click this button and I can run this task. Uh, it's going to run. It's going to show different statuses. So what are the different statuses and what are the different tasks uh, overview that we can achieve from here? I'm going to uh, cover that in my next video. Thank you very much for watching. For watching. Stay tuned.